Hello YouTube, back again with another um, video, Harbor Freight video. Today we're looking at the new items from Harbor Freight. As you can see, um, we got the banks, uh, the new banks line uh, mailers. We got the small, that's the small one. Um, we got the finishing nailers and the that's, I believe that's a roofing nail nailer, the one with the magazine. The, that one's a roofing nailer too. Um, they look pretty similar. Um, the old ones just have the black part as rubber. This one's uh, they got more rubber in them, and you see that gray line right there where I'm touching. Um, that's rubber too. So I guess they're a little bit more padded and more rugged. I guess you can call it. Um, they are nice. They feel good. Um, it's probably the same design, only like different colors, and you know they just change the outside, make them a little nicer, you know. But overall, the price is pretty decent too. I mean, it's they're almost the same price. You know, there's a few dollars difference, but um, but yeah, the piers are are nice. They got they come with the case. Um, the bags, um, I have no idea if they come with the case or not. I know the smaller one does come with the case, but, um, the big one might not come with the case. So I would have to open one up there. Let's see. But as you can see, the small one does come with the case. Um, so there's a chance that the, the big ones might come with the case too. But yeah, overall, they feel pretty good. Um... <clears throat> that's the piers. Those are the piers. That's the, the, that's the top of the Harbor Freight's top of the line uh, nailers there. You know. And then they also do have a new line of nails. Um, with the guns, they, they came out with the new line. Um. So I guess they were, you know, they're redoing their inventory and they're pretty much upgrading everything, you know, all the tools and stuff like that. So, which is a good thing because if they're getting more quality in the, the, the store itself, so, you know, they're throwing all the junk out, basically. That's a nice line, the earthquake line. Um, I don't know about the price though, you know, they, they're still nice tools and everything. But, you know, for the price, I would just stick to a, you know, a name brand for that. For the drills and stuff like that. Just play it safe. Um, but, yeah. As you can see, they have, like, a little duct system there. You know, I, I remember a, a while back when they, when all the, the viruses, you know, the, the viruses were in the hospitals and everything. They had those, um air circulation machines or something like that and uh, that's what we really reminds me of those uh, those air circulation air circulating machines I don't know if it's an AC or whatnot but, but yeah they used to have those at the hospitals when you know when all the viruses were out and uh, everybody was getting sick I guess yeah it's a, I haven't seen that before it's a, it's like a little like a vacuum there Some garden tools. Oh yeah, they, uh, that's the chainsaw. That's the new item. Well, it's not really new, but that's the new, you know, they brought it back. So that's the 14 inch uh, electric chainsaw. Um, it's worth $49.99, I believe. Is it? Yeah, $49.99. Uh, it looks, looks pretty good. I gotta buy one and try it out, see, see if, uh, if it actually works. Because actually I was looking some on Amazon and um, the cheapest one I found on Amazon was like $60 or $70. Um, and compared to this, this is $50. 
And if they do, do come out with the coupon, so it'll be a lot cheaper. You know, it'll be somewhat cheaper. So that is the cheapest chainsaw um, compared to Amazon. That's the new uh, heat gun. Um, I guess it has variable uh, speed and uh, heat. It's a nice little design they got. You know, they, they put a little bit more rubber, more color into it. So, um, but yeah, it's pretty much the same thing, but uh, a little fancier. And as you can see, there's the, the, oops, the level of the heat, how hot you want it. So you can turn that little dial, and then you got the speed of the fan there. But yeah, it's a nice little tool. But yeah, that's that's another new uh, addition to the Harbor Freight collection there. Little by little, I guess they're adding, you know, they're redoing their inventory and they're adding new stuff, higher quality. Here's a new item, um, uh, Armstrong uh, form, uh, uh, TV mount. Um, if I can pull it out. Yeah, that's actually a, not a bad deal. Um, I guess there's a coupon up for $14.99. I don't know if that's the regular price or not. But um, but yeah, there's you could you could swivel that pretty much side to side or up and down, and that's for like a up to a 42 inch TV, so it's not too bad. Yeah, just surprised about the new stuff they have you know that's the bike stuff the gas I didn't know I, I was actually um, searching for an, an Amazon um, I was trying to get one of these uh, jerry cans or similar products and I was looking at these, they're actually not pretty bad, you know, they're, if you could get one with the 20% off, um, I, I know I did some research about that cap that, um, that wasn't doing real good because it didn't seal, but I guess I, I, that's why I got it out and put it back, um, to see if it was, uh, sealing it properly, but yeah, it looks like they, re they resigned the, redesigned the cap, so, um, you know, and if, if the cap breaks, then you can just buy another one, basically. But the, the can is actually metal, so, you know, when it gets hot here, usually the, the plastic will expand and and uh, there's cases that ex explodes and, you know, start leaking uh, fluid there or gasoline. It doesn't really explode, but it, it'll, it'll break, you know, eventually the, the plastic. Oh, and that's the new light, the Prawn uh, portable folding light. That's a new light there. That's not too bad for five bucks. Can't beat it. You know? It's 175 luminums. Um, I guess it's a. It's one of those lights you can have at the shop and you can just throw around everywhere. Because it, it comes with a lot of plastic and rugged material all the way around, I guess. So you can basically throw it anywhere. Sorry about the camera, guys. It's just hard to film and uh, with one hand and look at stuff. So. Yeah, and for any of the, if you guys are shopping at Amazon, um, feel free to uh, click on the links below and just you could buy that item or another item and uh, and we'll still get like a dollar for that item. And we're looking at the new um, uh, safe, security safe for the handguns or you can for documents. 
and that's the 25 um, watt solar panel. I guess that's fair, fairly new too. Um, it's a 12 volt, uh, 25 watt solar panel. And that's the newer one. That's the smaller one. It's a 1.5 watt um, solar panel that connects to the cigarette lighter. You can just keep your bed. Yep, and that's the old, um, the bigger solar panel system at the bottom. But yeah, that's the new um, uh, secu uh, portable security safe. They're advertising it for a handgun, so I mean, I'm pretty sure it fits the other documents and stuff like that. And I guess uh, if it's a handgun in a clip or something. For 19.99, it's not too bad. I mean, if it if it works, I haven't tried it myself. But if it works, I guess it's not that bad. You know, if you want to keep your gun safe, say, uh, you know, safe for your for if you have children and stuff. There's the measurement right there. It's about 10 by 7 and two inches high. So it fits most of the normal size guns. And that's the clearance. Um, it seems like they, they're clearing out of the central pneumatic um, finishing na uh, nail nails and uh, staples and all that stuff. Because um, they, they got their new, um, their new brand. So they're pretty much clearing out all the older stuff. And replacing with their new line of nails. Supposed to be higher quality, I guess. But yeah, that's the new line of nails they got. It's fast and strong. So, um, I haven't tried these myself. I know the other ones were, were kind of crap, to tell you guys the truth. Because um, I, I, I heard a lot of bad things about them. That uh, if you put Harbor Freight nails on the, on the nailers, you know, they'll get stuck and they'll... You get jams and stuff like that. So I guess they, they heard it, you know. And they switched their lines. So. And that's the new Bauer um, drain cleaner. That's a big little suck. That's a big sucker right there. The cable is kind of cheap. But um, but then again, you're not going to be you know, pulling out the... Pulling, pulling it with the cable. Um... But yeah, and it does come with a little, like, uh, um, like a shut off from the, from the connector, like a protector, you know, if it's, if, if it gets electricity, it'll shut off. And that's the new line of gloves, um, all the different colors, but yeah, they they got some nice gloves now, so. And it says they're mechanic gloves, so I don't know if I would be a mechanic and would be using these gloves. I'll probably just be using them for work, you know. But yeah, that's a new line of uh, gloves. And they got all different colors, you know. They got the green, blue, black, red. And the material seems to be pretty durable. They're gonna um, some nice padded um, on the bottom of the towards the front of the hand. And those are high visibility, I guess, for the for the construction workers. Not bad at all. And those are the leather ones. Leather white gloves. Yeah, they got all different types of gloves here in different colors. So, yeah. those are nice. But they'll get dirty real quick though.
They even cut uh, pink gloves there for for women. New designs. You see the the, the lines. That's the, the pad of the. They got like a little cushion in there on that part. Yeah, overall I guess Hubber Fate, so stepping the game, so. And that's the Bauer Sander and the Warrior Sander, so. Haven't seen this before. Um, it's 19.99. Looks pretty good from the outside, so. I guess, uh. Looks pretty decent. So. Palm detailed Sander. Sander. I wonder how how that will perform, you know, at the long run. Oh, that's the sander itself. There's a button, on and off button, I guess. Little bag on the back. And that's the power. Little nicer. Little bit more. Uh, Nicer material. Going over to the Bauer and the Warrior item items. That's the new Warrior drill. Um, it does come with the pad, a uh, rubber pad on the sides. So when you put it, you set it down. It doesn't, it doesn't hit. You know. That is the charger port, so it's like a little bullet charger thing. And there's the light on the back, I guess, the indication that it's charging. It's kind of your little entry level uh, drill. But um, for 40 bucks, you know, I would just definitely go with uh, something else. Not unless you get a coupon, you know. If you get a coupon and you get it lower, maybe 30, 35 bucks, I guess it's worth it. And that's the battery, 1999. Does come with the charger, that battery, extra battery. So, so I guess that's one positive, you know, of buying uh, this this drill that um, you can get the batteries pretty cheap, and um, seems to be a decent quality, uh, a decent quality drill. So, I mean, it's pretty. It's it's a little better than the than the drill master. Oh, and those are the new lights. They're apparently they're coming up with the new uh, line of uh, lights. Quantum. Um, a lot of these are out already, so um, there's a few of them that are not out. I guess um, the the short ones the short ones are the, not the ones that are out yet. So. And they're gonna be 19.99 3D flashlight, 534 luminums. That's gonna be the one that's gonna be on that um, that side. But yeah, the rest of the quantum line is out there already. So they're great lights. I do have that video for that um that work light that right there. It's 5.99. Yeah, I know. I like that one. I'll link the the video up above. And that's the new lantern. Um, it's a it's it's a heavy thing, you know. It's it's pretty heavy because it does carry. It does have, uh, I believe, four D uh, batteries, so it's a it's real powerful. And as you can see, you you turn it on and you're getting a lot of light there, enough to blind you. So I guess that's a perfect thing to go camping and uh, have a nice light out outside. It's 1250 luminums, uh, 360 degrees. It says four light modes, so. <clears throat> now, sort of the details right there. Yep, 4D batteries, all of the big fat batteries. It got all the 
the stuff that uh, you would carry a lantern, you know, a regular one. Um, that's the new tactical ammo box. Um, the top part is uh, it's like a little case there for your accessories or your quick items you want to grab. And then the bottom piece is just like a regular ammo box. The way you open it, I mean. I'm just trying to get it open with one hand, it's hard. <laughs> but uh, when you open it, you get the little tray there. And you can put your accessories there on that tray. Um, you know, like smaller stuff. You got two different calibers. You can put the, the big caliber on the, you know, the big caliber bullet on the bottom and leave the small caliber bullet on the top. That way you're not searching around and stuff. So, but yeah, that's a nice little case for $9.99. So it's not that bad. And it is plastic, so. Those are the toolboxes. Um, I do have the bottom one, the one with the black lid. So ho holding up pretty good. I have it in the sun. In the truck, so. Anyways, well, thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button, hit the subscribe, hit the bell icon to get other no notifications. Um, all right, we'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you. Thank you.